I got built-in shelter. This is so big. Have you ever seen a tree this big? Where did the llamas go? Hello, welcome back. Llama bean, llama. Fluff bean, llama bean. Where's my crazy little llamas at today? Oh, llama, fluff. <gasps> llamas, I spot llamas. Come on, guys. Oh, llama bean and fluff bean. Guys, you'll never believe where me and the llamas are at today. Llama Bean, why don't you tell them? Did you get that? Guys, we are at the Red Woods. Now, you will never believe what happened earlier, okay? Yesterday, little Llama Bean, she's coloring a tree, right? And she colors it red. Fluff Bean was like, oh, that's not right. Trees are not red. And Llama Bean was like, yes, they are. It's called the Red Woods. Fluff Bean has never heard of that before. And honestly, I kind of heard of it before, but I was just like, guys, we gotta go there right now. So I took the llamas there, and I don't really know anything about it. Fluff doesn't know anything about it, but little Llama Bean, she's an expert at the Red Woods. So today, guys, we're gonna go on a hike in the Red Wood, and Llama Bean's gonna teach us all about the trees and prove to us that you know trees can be red isn't that right llama bean yeah but fluff bean on the other hand fluff bean she still doesn't believe it that trees can be red fluff bean is like mm, is that like a candy wood like the candy land you know and i was like mm, fluff bean i'm kind of with fluff and then llama bean's like nope let's go so we are on a journey today guys for a huge adventure into the red woods are you ready llama bean Llama Bean says she's been so ready. Are you ready? Fluff! Fluff! Let's do this thing! Yeah! Let's go on a hike. Wow, Llama! Llama Bean has so much energy right now. <gasps> Guys, this sign looks a little dangerous. It says no dogs or no bicycles. Mm. <gasps> That's right, Fluff. Fluff Bean just mentioned, she's like, well, it doesn't say no llamas. Hmm? Oh, Llama Bean Fluff Bean. You know what that means. Be careful, Llama Fluff. It doesn't say no llamas. <laughs> oh, crazy llamas. Breaking the rules. Actually, they're not, because it doesn't say no llamas. Hi, right, llamas. Oh, look. The llamas are talking to these crazy birds. Look at them. Oh, do you think they're real fluff or do you think they're cameras? Mm. The llamas said they can hear what they're saying. Oh. oh, llamas. The birds are saying they know exactly where the big trees are. They're right down the trail. Oh, llamas, it's a good thing they understood them. <gasps> What'd they say just now, Llama Bean? Oh. Llama Bean said we gotta go right now, they said. Come on, guys. Who would have thought that the llamas could understand what those crows were saying? Was that Fluff? <gasps> wow! Fluff Bean said that one of the crows just said, on our way to see the bigger trees, there's this tree that has a shelter in it. Wow, let's see if that's true. Ooh! What is this? Wow, it's very spacious in here. It's like a built-in shelter. Llamas, if you ever get lost here in the forest, this is where you'd wanna go. This is so fancy. You know, I wonder if any creatures live in here already. Mm. Mm. What's that, Llam? <gasps> you wanna know if there's any bears in here? Go ahead, Llama, sniff it out. Nope, Llama says we're in the clear. We're good. All right, let's keep exploring. Ooh. Now this is a fancy one. Mmm. Fluff. Wow, fluff. Guys, check out this. Look how long that goes up there. Like, mm. like imagine if you were stranded and you had to make a boat. Actually, no, this thing's over 2,000 years old. Fluff bean, what do you think of this? Here, llama. 
Go ahead and you can climb up the tree. I trust you, llamas. Llama bean, you got to gently grip onto it. Oh, llama. Look at Fluff though. Fluff bean is really growing up. Just look at her climb the tree. That is so crazy. Mm. Oh, llama bean. <gasps> that makes sense, llama. Llama just told us that there was a fire over a hundred years ago in here. It was so huge. However, these trees are so strong because their bark is so thick that it withheld and now the tree looks like this and it's kind of like a hideout. Right, Lama Bean? Right. Did you get that, Fluff? This is just so insane. All right, Lama Bean, why don't you jump down here and we'll continue on. Go on, Lama. Let's go. Wow, guys, check it out. The Lama's just sniffed out a deer. Look. He's right there. Why don't you go ask the deer for some food? It's getting so tired. I need to take a break right now, guys. It is exhausting on this huge hike. Oh, you're probably wondering, where's the llamas right now? Well, little llama bean, she's right there. She was so hungry. She said she sniffed out some lettuce. Oh, llama, look how cute she is. She's adorable. Now, little fluff bean, she said she really wanted to go exploring still. And she she's over there. What's that, fluff? Uh-huh. <gasps> wow, guys, look at fluff. Fluff bean, don't go in there yet. I'm gonna get a little llama bean. We can all go in together. Come on, llama. Oh, llama, I think you had enough lettuce. I know, you wanna eat more lettuce. Come on, we gotta go explore this cave. Come on, llama. Oh, llama bean. Llama bean's so excited right now, she can't even blink. Oh, no. <gasps> wow, look at this cave. It looks so dark in there. So scary, so creepy. Mm. We gotta watch out for creeps, some bears, you know. Mm. Let's go check it out. Come on, guys. Oh my gosh. Wow, llamas, this is so creepy. I wonder if the creep lives in here. Mm. This is so scary. Like, what other creatures live in here? I know, llamas. Guys, if you were here right now, you would feel that the weather in here is just like 10 degrees cooler. It's really cool in here. Wow, it looks like somebody's been living in here for sure. I mean, just check out that shelf. Wow, a built-in shelf. Llamas, go ahead, try it out. Oh, fluff, llama. Oh, llamas. I know llamas. I know. This could definitely be a place to stay if we ever needed to. Right, llamas? Right. I don't think we'll ever need to, though. Come on, guys. Let's go explore something else. Llama bean, what are you looking at right now? <gasps> wow. Guys, check this out. It's a circle. Lama Bean, can you just explain why these trees are in a circle right now? Because me and Fluff Bean, we are just super confused. Mm-hmm. Whoa. Mm. Mm. 
That makes sense, Lama Bean. Lama Bean said that there was this giant, massive tree, like, living right there, and then when it died, its roots floated in the air, and now they're into their own trees, and now it's a circle. Wow, Fluff, did you get that? <laughs> Fluff said kinda. It'll get there, Fluff. I'm still processing it, too. Come on, Lama Bean. Why don't you teach us more about the redwood? You want to find a four-leaf clover? Why? Oh. Mmm. Lama Bean just said she wants to find a four-leaf clover so that she can get Chick-fil-A. Fluff Bean, didn't you have Chick-fil-A yesterday? Fluff Bean was insisting on Chick-fil-A, so I got them both Chick-fil-A. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. Fluff Bean said yes, but it's always good to have Chick-fil-A two days in a row because it's just really good for the soul. Mm, Fluff Bean, I don't know about that. You got you two little llamas are gonna have to look really hard for a four-leaf clover because I'm not getting Chick-fil-A two days in a row unless you llamas did something very good. Oh, mm-hmm. They just said that they're so cute that they get away with it so they should get Chick-fil-A. Well, you llamas better keep looking for that four-leaf clover so you can get extra lucky. I don't know about that, Llama Mama. Did you bring your monies? Yeah, Llama Mama always has to pay for it. They didn't bring their monies. Llamas? Oh, Llama being fluffy. What time is it? Oh, where are we? Oh, we're in the redwoods. That's great. Come on, Lamas. <gasps> wow, Fluff Bean. Fluff Bean just whispered to me. She was like, mm, Llama Mama, I still don't know why they're red. Well, Llama Bean, can you come in and just like tell Fluff why? Oh, Lamas. <gasps> oh. Oh, Llama Bean. <gasps> Llama Bean says she's just going to sniff out the answer. What does that even mean, Llama Bean? Okay. <gasps> oh, Llama. Fluff Bean, come check this out right now. Just look at it. Oh, that makes sense, guys. As you can see, the inside of this tree is red. Now, that makes sense on why Lama Bean colored her tree red. See, Fluff Bean? Mmm, go ahead, sniff it. Fluff Bean says it smells like a Jolly Rancher that's red. Mmm, that makes sense, Fluff Bean. That does. All right, Lama Bean, Fluff Bean, I think it's time to continue our journey into the woods. I know, Fluff Bean. I know. Stop crying, Fluff. Fluff Bean, don't cry. Fluff Bean is crying right now because she says it's not fair that the squirrel gets to eat, but Fluff Bean doesn't get to eat. Now, Fluff Bean, let me know this. Did you end up finding the four-leaf clover so we can stop at Chick-fil-A? No? Well, Fluff Bean, you better get in there and find a four-leaf clover. Either that or ask the squirrel to share. No! Oh, Fluff. All right, Fluff, I'll help you find one. Llama Bean, what is this? Can I see it? Guys, check this out. This right here is a redwood tree seed. It's a little tiny flake. Think of a little oatmeal flake. This right here turns into a big 
massive tree. This specific one is 270 feet tall. That is so crazy tall, guys. Just think about it. This is the size of a 25 stories skyscraper, guys. That is so big. Now, Lama Bean, can you explain how many of these trees actually grow? Oh, she said she has a pine cone for us too. Oh, Lama Bean. Now this makes more sense. You guys saw that flake? Well, the flake comes from this. And all of these flakes, they float around when they dry and only a few lucky ones, they get to grow as big as this because they get the right sunlight and they get the right placing on the floor. Now some of them, they get caught up in the floor with all the leaves and they don't get to get this big, but this one's a special one. And little Lava Bean, she found it. Good job, Lava Bean. Let's go see if we can find an even bigger one. Oh my goodness, llamas. What did you find? Fluff bean, llama bean. Wow, fluff bean, this thing is huge. This tree looks like it eats more than you do. Oh, fluff. Let's just look around this, guys, and see it, because just look how gigantic this is. Llama bean, how many pieces of lettuce do you think this tree has eaten? Look at it. She said 328,654. Wow, Lama Bean, that is a lot of lettuces. You know, I wouldn't be surprised because just look at this. Guys, this is so big. Have you ever seen a tree this big? Leave a comment down below. Me and the llamas, we are super concerned. Whew. Guys, it's been a really long day. Let's just think about it. We saw a bunch of squirrels. We saw the deer, the birds. The llamas talked to the birds. We learned all about the redwood trees. Llama Bean, you did so good teaching us about it. Fluff Bean, now you know that trees can be red on the inside, you know, but they're still red. But yeah, me and the llamas, we're probably gonna go get some food right now. Hopefully, this park doesn't close on us and we get stuck in here. That would be a disaster. What's that, Fluff? Oh. Oh, <gasps> Fluff Bean makes a good point. She said if we get stuck in this park, she would just stay in the tree cave. And we could just sleep there for the night. That's a good idea, Fluff Bean. Would you guys ever stay in the tree cave? Leave a comment down below. That's a little risky because you don't know if there's gonna be a bear in there, if a, another creature's gonna come up on you like a snake. No sharks though. There won't be any sharks. And the llamas are scared of sharks, remember that? But anyways guys, Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Me, Little Llama Bean, and Fluff Bean, we love you so much. Say bye, Llama. Bye. Say bye, Fluff.